Here we go, baby. July crew pack. Let's go. We got the Loki skin here. I'm currently wearing the Loyal Shield back bling, which actually goes pretty damn well. The back bling is Loki's cape. We have Loki's scepter. Ooh, nice impact. We have the Chitari chariot. Uh, my, my apologies if I mispronounced that one. And then a loading screen. Okay. Let's do this. The weapon wrap is the melty gold. Now you could stretch some blue from the harvesting tool if you wanted to. ADS isn't terrible with this helmet he's wearing. It's not terrible. I'll say that. Yes, the black is a little darker than what I was looking for in terms of his fabric. Um, his, if, his fabric? <laughs> in terms of his fabric. But let me tell you, the gold is pretty spot on here with the weapon wrap. Not bad. A little shinier, but it's fine. So we do have a brand new glider as well. The Chitari Chariot. Again, if I butchered it, my apologies. Nice deploy. We got some purple here too. Left. Right, forward. Nice. I want to do that one more time. I like that we have like the purple trail coming off of it. Deploy is cool. Go backwards here so we have some interaction here with the wings my dog is barking thank you so much for that worst timing ever okay equip and equip nice streak sound is decent i like it i'm not a fan of the cape that's just me impact animation really good Really, really good here. It's good. Another look at this. And happy belated birthday to Ricky J. Feels great. Pretty cool harvesting tool. I like it. It's not too bulky or anything. Pretty unique sound here. Great impact animation. Really cool here. Nice impact when you're farming as well. I like the blue sparks coming off of it. Again, ADS here, in case you forgot. It's not bad. The rap's okay with it. Let's take off the cape real quick. So I'm not going to lie. I don't know a lot about Loki. Big surprise, but I have been watching the series on Disney+. Plus. I just finished episode three right before item shop here. So I'm going to watch episode four tonight. But with that being said, combo time. All right, guys. Combos were tough in terms of the back bling. Back blings on Loki were not bad at all. But let's start with the cape here. Um, Battlehound. It's a really clean combo. Um, it kind of goes with everything there. His tattoos, the gold. Um, black heart. Now, it did take me a long time. We have stage eight with the brown style here. It took me a long time to just find two rows of skins here to showcase this cape on. I went up and down my locker probably five to six times. And unless I'm just very small in cranium, this, I just want to show it. This, it's funny how they're side by side when I'm favorited. Cause I, I said on Twitter, this was my, uh, my early Loki skin just because of the, uh, the green and gold nature and the, like the helmet, etc. It doesn't look good on him though. Kit bash, major stretch, but I like the way it sits on the, um, the AC unit on his back. Now he does have green, but maybe not that exact forest green. Very strong Australian green clover. This is one of the strongest. Now, the green is slightly off, but still, it kind of matches the nice details on her armor. We have Seawolf here. Kind of a stretch. We got that green around his neck, though, and then he has a little bit of gold here and there. Uh, fa -la 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 fish stick. Kind of not really there. Not a fan of the back bling, man. Um, I think, it, I think like, what makes a good back bling in, in terms of, like, a cape is how it sits on characters. Like, if it has, like, an interesting um, transition... On the back bling in terms of where it connects i think that can make or break a cape and i'm just not a fan it was very tough in terms of combos here um eternal shield gold we could also do um with the super level on that looks pretty clean um if you're like if you're running obviously his harvesting tool you can do some blue combos here because it does have the blue in the tool the infinity gauntlet you knew was coming that's what it came with adventure pack um kind of a stretch here but we got the green and gold doesn't really look that good Golden Disco is gold, very easy. The Globe with two E's. Um, the Ghost Skim Board, color-wise, sure. Theme-wise, um, uh, not really. Um, the Double Agent Stripe, sure, why not? The Diamond Grid. Now, this orange reminds me of 
forgive me i forgot what it was called a little time portal thing jumper the thing that he has that he broke in episode three i'm just saying that orange that was a stretch um bobo because he is um what is he the god of mischief and this is kind of a troll back bling if you ask me kick drum green and gold never get to use it doesn't make sense but we kind of have the colors we're looking for loyal shield very close green and gold nosh um because obviously nosh. mischief it's a very troll back bling number one with the gold style we have spires touch again um trying to go with someone that blew on his harvesting tool the dark knight movie cloak is a very clean cape you have a little bit of clipping on the hair there but still very clean honestly almost looks better than his original cape the timekeeper because he has to do a lot of stuff with timelines um again i don't know a lot about loki i'm trying to watch the series i know i'm probably missing a lot of information on him but so far so good just finished episode three we have the skeleton key with the gold the re-gifter um oh sure i guess the cobra is pretty close to a nice looking combo there and then the cheesy backplate honestly just going outside of the box of a color scheme i'd probably do something like hurricane with his harvesting tool you can see how it would be like a cool theme for like that blue color that's just me i'm just saying but loki um back bling was pretty tough not a huge fan of that cape but we tried our best i don't know i don't know and with that being said guys liking the video is always appreciated subscribing is free there is a reactive back bling i will cover after this video thank you guys so much for watching and we'll see you nerds on the live stream see ya